Hi, today we will prepare mixed Hakka noodles. Now this is a little time consuming and also sometimes it can be quicker also if you want to but that depends on the quantity and uh, also because there is a lot of uh, cutting to be done and frying. So we have uh, like uh, today I will be preparing a bigger quantity so it will have about one and a half kilo of uh, noodles. This is um, which are ready made noodles to all be cooked and you get in a Chinese uh, supermarket. Now I also have capsicum and uh, carrots. This is round beans, onion leeks, little um, garlic, about four or five cloves garlic, and uh, we have. Uh, for mixed uh, meats and uh, I've got some boiled prawns peeled and boiled with little salt, uh, turmeric and vinegar water and this also is uh, chicken boiled similar uh, with salt, vinegar and turmeric and this is ham so you use how much you want depending on your quantity I'm going to use this for one and a half kilo of uh, um, noodles plus also I have this uh, packet of noodles so I am going to uh, show how if you don't get ready made how to boil the noodles and uh, strain it and cool it and uh, then use it I also got I've got two eggs here I'll be using a couple more this is for garnishing at the end uh, making a like an omelet and then for garnishing and also now we have uh, I'm using chili oil this is ready-made chili oil and I have I'll show you how to make chili oil so we have refined oil and then chili powder so I'll be heating up the oil one cup of oil and two tablespoons of uh, chili powder cooling it and then straining it that will give me the chili oil you can put little soy sauce and that will give you this color and these are all for uh, uh, mixing with the noodles and the vegetables so soy sauce chili sauce tomato sauce pepper powder a little of each soy sauce so maybe a couple of tablespoons and chili sauce one tablespoon a tomato sauce maybe a couple of tablespoons and uh, uh, pepper powder maybe half teaspoon or one teaspoon depending on your taste now this is going to be slightly spicy you can reduce if you don't want don't use a chili oil just use ordinary oil now chili oil is for uh, the noodles frying the noodles and also the vegetables later on so all these have to be cut now, the vegetables, the uh, chicken, ham, garlic, they will be cut uh, fine, like the carrots would be strips, small strips, the julienne type strips and uh, even uh, capsicum I will be cutting into strips, this will be round beans would be cut slantwise. Uh, into small strips uh, the onion leeks of course will be cut into small bits and uh, then we will fry them so the salt also if you require more salt little salt you can put salt and uh, yeah so I will start with the chili oil oil now so this is I heated up a pan small pan and then uh, one cup of oil let it not be smoking hot, it slightly started uh, smoking but not very really fully smoking. Now I am going to put 2 tablespoons of chili. That's it. And remove. Now once it cools down, then I am going to strain it. When it cools down, I am going to strain it in this. I use the handkerchief, old handkerchief. I am going to strain it here and use that oil for 
frying the noodles and vegetables keep it aside so this is the chili oil that's come out now i strained it and this is the chili powder which i'm going to throw away and use this oil for uh, frying I'm going to boil this noodles just to show you how to uh, this so i kept some water about uh, four five cups of water and it's boiling so now i'll drop these noodles about 150 grams of noodles break and drop about um, for two three minutes and once they are nearly cooked that time we use the put little oil just uh, canola oil or any sunflower oil refined oil so that it doesn't stick to each other It's nearly cooked, so I'm drop little oil, one teaspoon. Oil. Little more, and then we take strain it. After straining, we'll pour cold water. I'm going to strain now. When it cools down, we'll toss it up a bit and then use that for the noodles. Along with the rest of them. I'm going to prepare omelette for garnishing. Now omelettes you can prepare the normal uh, omelette uh, what you prepare on the pan uh, and then you can cut it up later on in the strips or you can make uh, 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 thin uh, omelette and then roll it up and cut it so or you can just scramble and uh, use it for garnishing. So. The first one, I'm going to turn it round. And wait for it to cook. I, I put some uh, oil, chili oil before I started uh, put the omelet, beaten omelet. Uh, beaten egg sorry and now I'm going to remove this one is plain on on the I turned it over now this is fried so we have this one left. now the third one is just scrambled chili oil you can put ordinary oil also if you don't want spicy and then we scramble it so we have this Scramble, just plain scramble, and that will help for the also the pan. And I've got this omelet, and got omelet here. So what we do is we 
here, cut into strips. So when you open up, so you have strips of um. That is one way. All this is for garnishing. And the third omelette is mix it up all together. Is just making plain lines and cutting. That's it. Now I'm going to show you <coughs> how I cut them. So this is onion legs. Take off the edges. Don't want them. And then cut it. is round beans so cut off the edges again and then Carrot again, cut off the edges. I've cut already cut now. Make it into three or four parts depending on the size of the carrot, and then we'll cut this. Now capsicum, you can have all greens or you can have uh, different colors, normally we put all greens but uh, just for a change, we have different colors, take off the inside seeds and then cut them into strips, they have some color in it. So we have carrot, capsicum, round beans and onion leeks. <clears throat> Meats. So this is all optional. This is a mixed uh, uh, noodles. So I have got prawns. This is about 1 kilo of prawns which is peeled and boiled and uh, I'm going to use that all. And this is chicken about uh, 200 grams of uh, boiled chicken. This is ham, about 200 grams of ham. So I'm cut them into strips. <coughs> First I'll cut into half and easy strips. Chicken, again strips. You can cut it into half. And then Like I said, it's all optional. You can have only prawns, only chicken, or, little, or only ham, or only vegetable without the meats. And also we are putting the omelette pieces for garnishing. So that's it. We'll start with the um, frying of the noodles now. All the one tablespoon of oil this is to glaze the noodles and then i'll cut this noodle boy i already cooked noodles to this is the half kilo one packet then also i've got the one kilo packet 
and then I've got the one which I have boiled today. So I'll use all that. So I put in the noodles here. I'm going to stir fry for some time. So chili oil. If you don't want chili oil, you can use ordinary oil. Little, just to fry it, and then remove it. Basin for mixing, or you can put in a vessel wherever you want. Just for mixing, final mixing of all the ingredients. So I fried the noodles from the which I bought from the supermarket. Now I'm doing it with the noodles which I just boiled. It can, I mean, it is different type of noodles, but it's okay. You can add them all together. This I boiled just to show going to fry the vegetables so I put about 2-3 uh, tablespoons of um, chili oil and I'm putting going to put all the vegetables so first I'll put the carrot and uh, beans and when it cooks for about 2-3 minutes, then I put the capsicum. <coughs> Got the carrots, the beans, the capsicum. I put in the sliced garlic. And also the onion leaves and cook it for just fry it for some time it remains crunchy but uh, it fries a bit now the vegetables have been fried for about 7 to 10 minutes because there are quite a lot of vegetables there and water also comes out from it so now it's nearly dry you can do it individually each vegetable separately or all together little chili oil again and then I'm putting the chicken I'm going to fry it for some time just to get a glaze and the chili into it I've removed the chicken now now I put the prawns in so again I'm going to fry the prawns in a little oil they already boiled prawns to the same basin mixture, add it to the mixture. Now prawns are removed, now I'll add it the um, fry it and add it. Everything is fried. Now I'm going to mix all of this together before we add the sauces. I'm going to put about a teaspoon of pepper powder. Tomato ketchup, about 3 tablespoons. Chili sauce, about 3-4 tablespoons. This is for this quantity. You will have to adjust according to your taste. Now this is soy sauce. Now I'm going to mix all this up. Dark soy sauce is good. In some more soy sauce. A little more chili sauce. 
have not added any salt if you want you can add if you feel it's less and sauces again depending on your taste and this is here yeah. I've garnished it with the omelette and mixing it well again That is mixed Hakka noodles. Prawns, chicken and ham 